You all asked for it, so yes, here it is, the life of Lord Bentner. I would have made a draw my life for the Football Daily sooner, but Slatan and Rooney begged to go first, and as you all know, you don't need to draw to be a legend. I was born on the 16th of January 1988 in Copenhagen, Denmark. After brief spells for Tembi Bowl Club before moving to FC Copenhagen's feeder club Klobenhavns Bowl Club in 1998. My story really starts when in the summer of 2004, age 16, I signed for Arsenal. Arsene Wenger has said he almost signed Eto, Di Maria and Drogba in this period, but he didn't. He signed me, Lord Bentner, which tells you one thing, I'm better than all of them put together. I was loaned to championship side Birmingham City in 2006, but it didn't stop me making my international debut for Denmark aged 18. I scored in a 2-0 friendly win over Poland. They hadn't taken a beating like that since 1939. I went on to score 24 goals for Denmark. To put that in perspective, Messi has scored zero goals for Denmark. I signed a new five-year contract with Arsenal in 2007 worth £52,000 per week, which I made my shirt number. Some people might say this was arrogant, but haters gonna hate, 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 hate. By the way, I gave Taylor Swift the idea for that song. My first Premier League start came days later away to Everton. I was sent off after 74 minutes for two bookings. Was Ronaldo sent off on his Premier League debut? Don't think so. Then I began dating Danish socialite Caroline Lul Brokdorf. She's a baroness in the Danish royal family which is where my nickname Lord comes from. We have a kid called Nicholas. Hey, if it's good enough for me, it's good enough for him. In 2009, tragedy almost struck. I was lucky to avoid injury when I crashed my Aston Martin driving to training. I did what anyone who's a Lord at football would have done. I stripped naked by the side of the road. My body is my livelihood and I was desperate to find out if I was okay. So I took off all my clothes, even my pants, picked up a wing mirror that had come off the car and checked myself over, front and back. In 2011, I moved to Sunderland on low. I scored a phenomenal eight goals in 28 appearances, making me a legend amongst fans of the Black Cats. They love me so much in Sunderland that many fans offered to personally drive me back to London when my loan period came to an end. Thanks guys, your support means everything. On the last day of the summer transfer window in 2012, I was loaned out to Juventus. Although Juventus won Serie A that season, I failed to score a single goal. One bright spot was that Juve confirmed they had not sold a single Bentner jersey from the club shop all season, which just goes to show that whilst people like David Beckham are signed to sell shirts, I am signed purely for my footballing ability. I had expected to go to Real Madrid or Barcelona, but I chose to go to Wolfsburg. In August 2014, I signed a three-year contract with the Bundesliga side. It's easy to go to a big club and play with the best players, but Lord Bentner never takes the easy path. I've been involved in drink driving incidents, drunken bust-ups, and I've even rubbed little Lord Bentner on the window of a taxi after a drunken night out. If I concentrated on my football, I could be even better, but I need to give Messi and Ronaldo a chance. I don't go on the internet much, but I'm told my fans have created loads of memes saying how I deserve a Ballon d'Or. So thank you guys. Like I said, your support means everything. Sletem was born in a humble hospital in Sweden on the 3rd of October 1981 in Malmö, Sweden, to my parents, the father of Zlatan and the mother of Zlatan.